Hello friends, today in this tutorial we are going to learn how to create levels in Revit software. Level means like our floors, first floor, ground floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, like with how many floors we have, that many levels we should have here. Okay, so for creating levels, first we have to check how many levels we have in our drawing and all that. We have to see this. Okay, now if you see on the screen we have a new architectural plan open like architecture file is open here okay now if you see in the project browser we have here two levels in the floor plan level 1 and level 2 okay means like if suppose we take level 1 as ground floor and level 2 as a first floor okay now for this levels we have to make some changes so we have to go to the ribbon okay in the ribbon we have to select architecture tab okay in the architecture tab we have to go to the right corner and in the datum section we have to select level but in the floor plan level option will be disabled it will not be on it will be off okay so in order to create levels we have to select any elevation like whether it will be east north south or west whatever it may be but we have to be in any elevation so in this tutorial i will select east elevation i will click on the east elevation then here we have our levels what we have seen in the floor plan level 1 and level 2 so in this we can see the level 1 to level 2 height okay so level 1 to level 2 height here we have 0 to 10 feet okay now we'll do some changes to the levels okay so first what we'll do uh, we'll uh, increase the height from level 1 to level 2 we have 10 feet but I will make it to like 12 feet so for that what we have to do uh, below level 2 we have this 10 feet okay now you have to click on the 10 feet option and you will get editable option so type 12 in that and press enter you will get your level 2 height set okay now we have to rename so first I will rename the level 1 I will click on the level 1 and I will rename it as a ground floor okay and when I complete uh, writing, then I'll click enter. Then I'll get a pop-up window asking us to select yes. Then I'll select level two, and in the level two, I will type it as two dot first floor. And again, I will uh, press enter, and it will again show me a yes option. We have to select. Okay. Now, if you see here, our ground floor and first floor, it's visible on the right side. Okay, but you don't want you don't like it on the right side you want to have it on the left side so it's this this box if you can see this box we have to unclick okay then on the right side we have here this box so you have to click this box to enable the option on the left side okay so this is the difference if you uh, click on the box it will be visible if you unclick on the box then it will be disabled okay now if you want to have both sides we can have but it's not preferable we should have any either side like left side or right side and uh, I think right side is good for us so I'll make it for the right side now one more thing we'll add one level so in order to add level we'll select here level in the datum section okay now we'll start our level from ground floor okay so from the ground floor in point I'll select uh, in point I'll not click on in point I'll just uh, hover it okay then I'll move my cursor up then I'll give my distance how much we want 24 feet I want like from ground floor to second floor the height should be 24 feet okay so I'll type here 24 okay then I'll click enter so if you see here we have got our level new level have been created okay and the height is also is assigned now just we have to rename it so i'll rename it as three dot second floor and again i will press enter and i will select yes okay now this is the procedure for creating levels in rivet okay now if you want to go for the ground floor floor plan so click on that bubble blue bubble so you will be in the ground floor plan okay again if you want to go for the first floor floor plan from the elevation so you can click 
on the first flow bubble okay so like this we have to do but still if you have uh, if you are uh, having any problems creating levels or editing levels okay so you can write us in the comment section as soon as possible we will get to you okay if you like our videos our tutorials please do subscribe and share with your friends definitely by time by time we will improve ourselves and we will try to deliver our best okay thank you once again for encouraging us to deliver this kind of awesome tutorials